All right, we got some really exciting news, and wow, this is pretty crazy. So, uh, the Bandai, I guess the Bandai event that's happening, or the hobby event, whatever you want to call it, looks like we got ourselves the Destroy Gundam HG. Holy crap, this was something that we've been waiting for a really, really long time for this, and this was really exciting news because I'm like, wait a minute, they're actually doing it? And I had to, you know, do a little research, I'm like, is this really true? Because, you know, someone could have made a mod of it or, you know, it could have been a third party. But no, this is officially Bandai 144 Destroy Gun. And holy crap, this is bulky and it looks great. And they even have at the events you can see here. Because with all these beams, for I assume for each finger and literally all these parts right here. Uh, yeah, this is this is insane. And just from these photos and how big is compared to a freedom and the impulse. Yeah, this is pretty big. This is really, really big. And yeah, I mean, the feet are massive. Like, it's so beautiful. Like, I really, really like the way this looks. Like, this is super, super cool. Um, yeah, this is exciting. And you know what's even crazy about this event is that they have even more. Like, they even announced the Burka for the Narrative Gundam. And yeah, this is this is big. Like it looks like it's already been official. Uh, if you actually look at Bandai, let's go pull up Bandai's thing right here. So yeah, it's it's basically official that this is a bird call uh, for the narrative Gundam C packs. And I'm not too surprised they have this, but at the same time, I'm not really that excited for it to be honest. I'm kind of like eh, because it, it just reminds me of another new Gundam more like Unicorn. So for me, I'm like eh, not that big of a deal for me. But you know, it's still cool, I guess. But you know, again, not my taste and. Of course, it looks like they have more announcements for the, um, and of course, the metaverse, which is coming out. That looks really nice for what it is, so that's really cool. Uh, but that's not what we're talking about today, so I'm not gonna get too much into that. And of course, the Witch from Mercury expansion set. This is something that we all been waiting for, and it's not a P Bandai. It's just straight up, you know, release. So this is really exciting for us because we've a lot of us have been waiting for this, and we've been wanting this for a long time. Uh, we really like how the Doro Blade looks, so I guess I have to go buy one now so I can put this together. This one I don't really care too much about. I wasn't really a fan of the Michaelis, so for me, I don't really care. But the Doro Blade looks super cool, like with the shield and the, the, the gun. So yeah, I gotta go to my hobby shop soon and just pick this up real quickly before it goes up in price. And the Ferax weapon, the dual uh, rifles, was so cool. And luckily I have a Ferrak myself. I'm actually currently building it right now, so that's exciting. And there might be some other ones right here, but maybe they're focusing on the expansion set. So thank you, Bandai Gods, for that. That was really cool. Oops, went the wrong way. But yeah, no, this this looks fantastic. I'm, I'm really excited for this. The expansion set looks great. And I think they announced it here. Let me double check here real quickly. Uh, nope, just, just on that side. I thought I saw somewhere else the picture. But anyways, this is cool. This is really, really cool. Okay, here we go. Here's a better website for the Twitter on Bandai Spirits. Uh, these are clearer images, again, for the expansion set. They look really nice. I wish we had a better image of the Ferrax, so hopefully someone posts that too later on. Uh, here's what the expansion set comes with. Honestly, I think it's definitely worth the, the set for sure. I'm definitely picking this up. Like this is small things like this just makes it so nice. So I'm excited for this. Like the Ferrax weapons, um, and as well as the um, hmm, I thought there were two in there for some reason. It didn't look like there's two, but anyways, hopefully they have double this because you know it's not sure how that's supposed to look. Because from here, we're going to need more info on that. So, uh, yeah, that's that. this expansion set's not going to cut it. So they're going to have to make it more better looking. Because it doesn't look cool right now. I wonder if there's another one. See, that's what I'm wondering. But anyways, I'm excited for this, guys. What are you guys' thoughts? Are you guys excited for the uh, announcements so far? And it's going to be all weekend. So I'll definitely be posting a lot more over the weekend. Uh, it looks like there's already an Epion ready to go. So check that out later. Uh, but yeah, what do you guys think? What are you guys' thoughts? Are you guys excited for this? Uh, and if you want to support the channel, uh, be sure to subscribe, uh, comment, leave a comment, show your thoughts on it. Uh, it all helps with the page. Thank you, and see you guys next video. Hey, I was watching that.